Announced at the Google Pixel 8 Pro launch in October 2023, Video Boost is now rolling out to Pixel 8 Pro devices now. Those of you who do not know what Video Boost is, well, if you are recording videos, you no longer have to worry about shaky or imperfect videos because with the Tensor G3, Video Boost on the Google Pixel 8 Pro is going to take that video which you have just recorded, which might be shaky, grainy, and that video is going to be uploaded to the cloud wherein google's computational photography models are going to adjust the color lighting stabilization and graininess and once that process has finished you are going to get a video which is better than what you had recorded and other than that video boost also enables night sight video on the google pixel 8 pro which is going to use ai to apply noise reduction to the videos recorded at night or in low light conditions on the google pixel 8 pro and of course i'm mentioning the pixel 8 pro a lot because video boost is exclusive to the google pixel 8 pro only next up let us see how you can actually use video boost on the google pixel 8 pro so for starters do note that even if you have the december patch you might not have video boost in your camera application because it is being rolled out in batches you do of course need to be on the pixel camera or the google camera version 9.2.113 or above once you have updated i think there's an update to another application which is needed maybe the AI core also needs to be updated to enable video boost on the Google Pixel 8 Pro. Once that is enabled and you go into video mode on your camera, you are going to get a pop-up notification about video boost being enabled. So how do you use video boost? And before I say anything else, here it is on your screen, you can see I did get a toast notification to try out video boost. But important thing to remember is that you do have to enable video boost every time you're trying to record a video it doesn't stay enabled and where do you find video boost well go into your camera application and then go into camera mode on the bottom go into settings and you should see the option for video boost bam here it is you can see that video boost is turned off if you tap on the question mark it is going to give you some information about video boost and how it works with night sight but once you enable video boost then on the top right also you're going to get a notification about video boost so here it is right now i am recording in full hd but video boost does work in 4k as well so if i change my resolution to 4k you will notice that video boost is still enabled so 4k right now and on the right hand side this icon with the star the camera icon or the video recorder icon with the star tells me that video boost is enabled and once you have enabled video boost on the pixel 8 pro made sure you have checked your resolution you want 4k or full hd all you have to do is tap on the record button and now you are recording a video do note that the maximum duration for video boost is 10 minutes anything longer than that is not going to work and once you have recorded your video all you need to do is stop the recording and then if you go into your google photos application you will notice that the video which i just recorded you see we have the same icon besides it the video recorder with the star this is telling me that this video here is a video boost and then the other thing if you tap on that specific video you will notice that you have the video boost icon over here as well so you have two videos and if i select this second option you will notice it is telling me it is backing up for video boost this may take some time you will get a notification once video boost is finished and of course you need to make sure that you have your photos and video sync enabled on your google account in the photos application then if you head over to the files application and here and if i go into my internal storage and then i can go to the folder where i know the videos are so dcim camera you will notice that i have this video over here so this is the video which i just recorded 11 or 12 second 4k video was like 40 mb so this is the cover this is the one which is available for preview right now and the one right below that this is the main video this is actually like kind of the raw video which is being uploaded to google cloud and there in computational photography will kick in process the video remove shakiness graininess increase the colors boost the colors and that is what is video boost now in my personal experience video boost can take a lot of time because 
I uploaded a 30 second 1080p video and it took almost 90 minutes for it to process on the cloud, the computational photography to do its magic and that is when I got a notification that video boost was complete. Do note once video boost has finished successfully this raw file is going to be deleted. So here is an example above it. This is the one which I recorded. The cover one is the one which is ready for preview right now. You can see it is 95.55 MB. Then I have video boost hyphen 03 main. So this is the one which was actually boosted on Google's servers using computational photography and then it was downloaded or I downloaded it on my device. You can see it is 92.03 MB. So this raw video eventually gets replaced with the video which has been boosted, which is why right now this one here is named VB-02 main, but once video boost has finished successfully on the cloud, this is going to be replaced with VB-03 main on my Google Pixel 8 Pro. And before we end the video, if I go back into my Pixel camera or Google camera application, go into video mode, go into settings, you will notice that video boost was automatically turned off. So as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, you do have to explicitly enable it every time if you want to use it in a video before you start recording your video. And there it is peeps. That is everything you need to know about video boost on the Google Pixel 8 Pro.